And good evening, everybody. Thank you for being with us tonight. I'm Eric Fink. It's been a very busy weekend for the U of A and college sports. On Friday night, the university announced it will leave the Pac-12 for the Big 12 next year. And now today, we learn U of A President Robert Robbins and Athletic Director Dave Heakey will address the move publicly for the first time on campus tomorrow morning. We're all over the story tonight. Bringing in sports anchor Jenna Fink now to lead us off. She's been following the developments all weekend, and our Connor McGill is live tonight from Hotel Congress with more on how this conference move will impact local businesses. First to Jenna, the football team practicing today, the first time since the news broke. Jenna, you were there, and with everything swirling around, what was the atmosphere like today at practice? Well, Eric, a lot of high energy at practice today as uh, perhaps a weight off everyone's shoulders as they know where Arizona will play in 2024. Head coach Jed Fish says he isn't worrying or wondering about the future, allowing him and the team to lock in on the 2023 season. The Wildcats hard at work today as they prep for their final season in the Pac-12 before moving to the Big 12. And there was a special guest at practice today, U of A President Robert Robbins. We'll hear from him and Athletic Director Dave Heakey tomorrow. But Dr. Robbins spoke to the team after practice today, and Coach Fish shared the president's message to the team. He's been to a lot of practices over the last couple of years, and he's seeing, I think, the differences in the guys from um, where they were uh, when we first got here to where they are now, the competitiveness, the energy, um, the size, the speed. He certainly recognized that, and then obviously talked about the importance of our focus being on this year in the Pac-12. Coach Fish also said Robbins touched on the transition to the Big 12. Coming up in sports, we'll hear Coach Fish's thoughts on the move, plus how the first week of practice went for the Wildcats. Back to you, Eric. Jenna, we'll see you then. Thank you. This